Hey guys, Edward here from Edward79, the mixed content creator. Now, learning a new language seems hard, and it really is. But if you're just getting started, did and are a native English speaker like me, consider trying out one of these compa these top 10 comparatively really easy languages. In today's video, I'll be talking about the top 10 easiest languages to learn for English speakers. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Now, when it comes down to it, most of what makes Danish harder than Swedish and Norwegian is pronunciation, as Danish is often reported to be significantly harder to pronounce than the other two. In fact, there are quite a few people that'll say, that'll actually say that pronouncing Danish makes you sound like you're drunk as the language has an insanely relaxed pronunciation. There are other things that make Danish comparatively hard, including to but including but not limited to word or genders and word order. But even so, Danish grammar and sentences are actually really easy. See, it's actually the pronunciation that makes the language all the harder compared to the other Nordic languages. And believe me, the pronunciation really makes the language a pain to learn. But pronunciation aside, Danish is actually surprisingly easy for English speakers, even though it's not as easy as Norwegian or Swedish. While learning Romanian, similar to German, seems nothing more like a pipe dream for most who have English as their mother tongue, you'll actually be very relieved to know that Romanian is actually quite easy. Just like English, most Romanian vocabulary has Latin roots, but it actually has closer ties to, Sp to languages like Spanish, French, Italian, and Portuguese, these due to all five being Romance languages. So if you can also speak, speak Spanish, Italian, or any of the Romance languages, you've already got a head start. Pronunciation isn't too difficult, but please be aware that learning it too late can, le can lead to mistakes or trip-ups ups in the long run, so it's best to learn Romanian early. And while the grammar can be difficult as well, it's still oh, unlikely native English speakers will have that hard of a time I'm learning such a surprisingly easy language. If you're looking to travel to Europe but don't want to learn several different lang several different languages, then German might just be your lucky ticket. It's not just used in Germany, but also in Austria, Luxembourg, Switzerland, and Liechtenstein, making learning it ideal if you want to travel to any of these countries. Fortunately, however, German is actually nowhere near as hard as people say, and is actually quite easy. Sure, it's most definitely not a walk in the park, but it's still pretty easy. The grammar is relatively easy, with clear, straightforward rules and recognizable patterns, and the fact that English and German are both Germanic languages makes it all the easier. And while it can seem really hard at first, once you get past that hard part, it should be, be relatively smooth sailing from there. So while German is definitely not a cakewalk, the language still is, is, comparatively speaking, really easy. As a language that seems very similar to Spanish, Portuguese still holds the record as one of the easiest languages to learn for English speakers, particularly so if you already know and or speak Spanish, as Portuguese and Spanish have a lot of similarities. Similar to many languages on this list, the language's grammar and conjugations are, similar to in Spanish, very simple, and the vocabulary is very straightforward, most definitely more so than other languages. And even though, just like Romanian, Portuguese isn't a Germanic language like English, there are still plenty of Portuguese words that are similar to English ones, as both share roots with Latin, directly so in the case of of Portuguese and indirectly so in the case of English. However, like German and some other languages on this list, word genders can be tough, especially if you speak a gender-neutral language like English. But overall, the 
Oh, Portuguese is pretty easy. As one of the most widely taught second languages by schools here in the U.S., French is rather is easily rather popular as a second language right up there alongside German and Spanish. The good news is that French is really easy, as the English language itself actually borrowed a lot of words from French, and as such, many of the spellings, pronunciations, and meanings of French words should come to you very easy. And even from day one, it's surprisingly easy to get started. Unlike other languages, which is where getting started is one of the harder parts. And while French isn't a Germanic language like some of the others on this list, and thus isn't that closely related to English, like I said before, a lot of English words were borrowed from French, so the words are pretty easy. As for the grammar, it's harder but not too hard. And French is overall a pretty easy language for English speakers. Just like French and Portuguese, Italian is not a Germanic language, and not exactly very close to English, instead being a Romance language alongside Spanish, Portuguese, among others. Despite this, English borrows more than a quarter of its words either directly or indirectly from Latin, oftentimes through another through a Romance language, most notably French, which is only one of the reasons why Italian is so easy. Another is how similar the vocabulary is. Many Italian words are exactly the same or very similar to their English counterparts, and as such, Italian becomes surprisingly easy after you start noticing these words. However, not all Italian words are similar. Some are very different, but enough are similar to make learning the language easy. See, er, well, easier. As for the grammar, it's not that hard, although you may find it a tad bit harder than some of the other languages' grammar. In summary, Italian is one of the easiest languages for English speakers and most definitely deserves a spot on this list. Being sort of a mashup between English and German, Dutch is undoubtedly one of the easiest languages to learn for English speakers. E one of the biggest reasons is similarity to English, as Dutch is a Germanic language just like English and German, and so if you know or speak either, you're in for a surprisingly easy time. And what makes Dutch that much easier is that, just like with French, a lot of English words were borrowed from Dutch. And it goes the other way around, too, as many Dutch words are similar or the same as English. And as such, getting started is really easy, just like French. However, like all languages, there are hard parts. For one, just like Danish, Dutch pronunciation is a nightmare, as the language is full of insane letter combinations, and the, sun and the sometimes crazy word or order also doesn't help. Overall, however, Dutch is comparatively easy, arguably even more so if English is your mother tongue. Being the second most spoken language in the world after Mandarin Chinese, Spanish is far and away an incredibly useful language to learn. And luckily for native English speakers, Spanish is an incredibly easy language to learn. One thing that makes Spanish comparatively easy is that it's a phonetic language, meaning the words are pronounced just like, like how they're written. Spanish grammar, too, is relatively easy. See, compared to other languages, but I warn you, it's still not exactly a cakewalk. As for genders, Spanish is gendered, but similar to Dutch, gen Spanish has two genders for nouns, masculine and feminine, and unlike German, there are no gender-neutral nouns. And although you may not suspect it at first, many Spanish words are somewhat similar to their English counterparts, making for an overall very easy language for native English speakers. As a Germanic language just like English, it's no surprise that Swedish is comparatively relatively really easy for English speakers. The grammar is fairly simple, but the pronunciation, although nowhere near as hard as Danish, can still trip up newbies if they're not careful. But because it's a Germanic language, 
Just like du like in Dutch or German, a lot of words in Swedish are similar or the same as in English. And going back to grammar, Swedish sentence structure is also rather simple, so mastering it isn't too hard. However, even though the words are usually easy, there are some words that sound so different from their English it's meaning, meaning that they can easily throw you off, especially those annoying, unfamiliar compound words. But some particularly annoying hard parts aside, Swedish is a language comparatively easy to learn. And for not just English speakers, but also speakers of other, other Nordic languages, like the last language on this list. Finally, we've come to the easiest language for English speakers to learn, that being Norwegian. It shouldn't be much of a surprise at all considering it's a Germanic language and shares a lot of words, words either in common with or very similar to English, and as such, the basics are anything but hard. And speaking of the basics, once you have them, them down, the rest of the language should be comparatively pretty easy especially in the case of grammar, in which once you get the basics down, the rest of the grammar comes more naturally and is easier to pick up. Pronunciation on the, pronunciation on the other hand is probably the hardest part of the language. As just like with Swedish, Norwegian most definitely has its fair share of words or it's more than ready to trip you up, up with pronunciation. Overall, however, Norwegian is one of, if not the easiest language for an English speaker, and definitely worth a shot even if you're not moving to Norway anytime soon. So there you have it, the top 10 easiest languages to learn for English speakers. We hope you enjoyed this video. As always, make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Mm -hmm.